At the launch of the New Year School, the Finance Minister Ken Oferiata had some concerns about Ghana's universities and the quality of students they turn out for the job market. An economy or global economy that is driven uh, by digitization and so even though the jobs are in that direction, we have less than a thousand graduates of IT related skills every year. What has put the universities to sleep? without realizing this major shift in where the world is going. With regards to how we are training our people for, for the future. We sought a reaction from Professor Ransford Yaojampo, Senior Lecturer at the Political Science Department of the University of Ghana. Our core mandate is to train people, train their mind, so that their minds become so fertile to be able to fit into any other situation they find themselves. That's the reason why somebody studies linguistics, classics, and philosophy, and is able to get out of school and go ahead and bank. Because as far as I'm concerned, we have several vocational training centers, and they churn out students who still also cannot find you. If you like, let us now convert the universities into vocational training centers and see whether the students who go out will find the jobs. He raised fundamental issues about how there are no job openings to even create demand for labor. Rather than um, trying to put the blame on us, I think they should accept part of the blame by admitting the fact that they have not been also able to create that kind of environment that would enable people who are entrepreneurs um, to survive. Anytime there are key interventions for private you know, people who want to go into entrepreneurship, these interventions go to party full soldiers, people who are completely clueless about setting up businesses. They are completely ignorant. But they say, hey, um, some money, government is sharing some money. And then if you are looking for those people who qualify for, to benefit from those resources, the, the first criteria is look at the party color of the person. And so at the end of the day, monies go to of resources that are meant to enable or help people who will be able to set up their own business. These resources go to people who are not qualified. 